Good morning, good morning. All right, you find us at the depot um, early in the morning, just after nine o'clock. Sean has just uh, put this Porsche on the trailer because we're taking that baby somewhere. So uh, where exactly, what's, what's going on today then, Sean? Uh, this one's gonna go for a camera change. All right. Okay, so this one's going off to the garage then somewhere. Where, whereabouts is it going now? The guy that specialises with these cars in Gothenburg. All right. All right, so like I said, we're setting off from Bros as usual, heading to Gothenburg with this one. But then after that, we're going to go and do something else, aren't we? Yep, we're going to pick up a Saab. All right, pick up an old Saab. So, there you have it. The life and times of an auctioneer. Early in the morning, mate. All right. So, right, let's get this baby to Gothenburg then and... Uh, yeah, we'll take it from there. It's not a game, it's a red skin. Get the Porsche off the trailer and uh, into the garage. Alltså, den svarta färgen var ju sällan. Uh -huh. det, det fanns inte så, så många svarta som. Nej. Nej, den, 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 den är ovanligt här. Ja, den är riktigt cool. Du, det, det, detta vi behöver inte tänka på att låsa, för det, det är bara jag har gjort så. Mm. För, för nyckel är väg. Mm. Lilla... Lilla pöle. Svartingen. Ja, men du, jag, jag har ägt den i, i så många år. Hur, hur många år har jag ägt den då? Jag har ägt den sen, sen 90. Oj. Ja. Det är en bit. Det är mm. några, några år. Ja. Nej, men, nej, men den, 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 den behöver ett, ett annat hem. Ja. Sen, sen, sen det börjar bli gammal och man har jag har skruvat med bilar sedan 60-talet, det, 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 vad säger man på, på, på engelska? Att uh, pila med bilen menar du? Nej men jag säger, det, det är nog nu. Okej, okay, det är enough. Is, Time is is, enough. Yeah. Ja. Times is up. <laughs> jag, 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 jag har lärt mig lite grann engelska mer och mer och, och, om jag ser på <laughs> TV-series. Utan, utan text. Ja, ja. Det var bra. Ja men du, jättebra att ni tar hand om det. 
Morning, Sean. We just picked up that Saab on the back there, yeah? Uh, so tell me a little bit more about that car then. Okay, it's a 1959 uh, Saab, 9.2 Deluxe, or 9.4, I can't, can't really remember, I've just, just seen it now. But the guy, old chap's had it for many, many, many years, and he's a super Saab enthusiast, as you can see, all the Saabs were passing here. Everyone in this area's got a, a Saab in the back garden. Yeah, Saabs on top of Saabs. We're only about, uh, <laughs> we're only about 20 kilometers from the old Saab uh, factory in Trolleton. Yeah. So this old chap, he's been working with Saab. I think he was a, de a detailer in the factory for oh, right. 20 or 30 years. Nice. And he's owned this car since 1990, so right. it's got a good history. And I mean, anything that's needed fixing, I mean, He's, he's, taken care yeah, of it. he's got, you know, he's, he's got the knowledge. He can fix it with his fingers. Well, we were talking to him out there, and he was talking about the condition of the paintwork as well. You can tell he was a detailer. Yeah. Uh, yeah. There's a lot of paint on that car, isn't there? Yeah, and it was repainted at the factory as well. So it's not everyone can take the car to the factory and get repainted. <laughs> so I think he said eight, seven liters of paint they used on the car. Yeah. There's a lot of paint for a small car. I mean, you can see it's professionally done, as you, as you said, it's been done at Saab's factory, but you can see there's so much paint on that car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, that's good. It's good for the next uh, next buyer. Yeah. So now it's uh, always a sad sad part with that owning cars, because owning something like this for 30 years, it's like part of the family, so selling it, it's, you know. Yeah. Like you said, now my, now my garage is empty. We just sold one of his other Saabs, uh, Saab, uh, V, V4, uh, right. 70s. So he said to me, just as, a, as we're moving, loading this, said, if you see a Saab 92 for sale, let me know because I need something in my garage. <laughs> so he, 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 needs, uh, he needs something to look at. Him. So he's still, he hasn't finished with Saab then, huh? No, no, no. <laughs> but I mean, it's like anything, you've, you know, 30 years is a long time to own a car, yeah. Yeah. and it gets to that stage in your life or time where you haven't got. You know, time to drive it or to enjoy it, and then it's like you know, feel sad to go in the garage and see it just sitting there all the time. Yeah. And an old car sitting still for a long time, it's not the best. Yeah, right. So uh, it's time to let it go to somebody else that's got a bit more time. Yeah, somebody else is a bit, you know, got more time to fix it, and you know, yeah. is looking for something like this. I mean, I love these, I love these old two-stroke engines. They're fantastic. You always get people like thumbs up. Yeah. I don't know if you saw the guy pass with the van. Yeah. He was like, Ooh. <laughs> so here he's like, you know, around this area, it's like Saab heaven. Yeah. <laughs> uh, do you know what? I've been living in Sweden for a while. I've never seen so many Saabs in one area of my life before. Uh, here it's just like, you have to have a Saab pulling a Saab. That's the way <laughs> the Saab life should be. Saab life. All right, we'll leave it there. Yeah. <laughs> So here we have it, back at the depot, the 1959 Saab. All right, see, so this car's gonna go up for auction at some point, and this is a real collector's item. So I hope you really enjoyed the show. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you did, and we'll see you all again next week for some more Cars of Sweden live. Thank <laughs> you.